Hey guys, welcome back to Smith Family Ranch. Today we have been uh, challenged to do a collaboration on if you could snap your fingers and have one project done, what would it be? Well, today I'm going to take you through a list of some of our major projects that we'd like to complete. And then at the end of the video, we're going to tell you which project we deem is probably the most important project on our homestead that will, that if we could snap our fingers, it would be done. Ready for it? All right, one project that we have that we're working on, as you've seen in pre previous videos, is our garden. This is one major project that we're trying to accomplish this year. We're not very good gardeners. Um, so we're trying to learn gardening. We're trying to learn tilling. We're trying to learn soil. We're trying to learn everything there is to garden. Um, and so that's one project that we have. Let's go see more. So this is another project that we have. This is our back pasture. We're going to be setting up rotational grazing this summer uh, for our cows. One of our major projects is actually two parts. One, setting up the actual rotational grazing along the fence line. Two, setting up pad paddocks for each uh, paddock for the cows and three the ground the soil the grass these are two different projects and one that we'd like to complete that if we could snap our fingers this would be done let's go take a look at another so this shed right here this was not a project at one point and up until recently wasn't even still a project and it has become a project so the backstory on this is it came with the house. Um, we really haven't done anything with it. But about March last year, a storm actually blew this shed out of the ground um, and thus has caused it to be a little damage. So what we want to do is move it up toward the house. I'd like to uh, reconstruct it, but have it permanently in the ground and use it as a hay barn for the wintertime, use it as a milking barn for the summertime, um, store things in it and actually utilize it, but repurpose it. So this is one of our projects. So this is another project. This is where our pigs are going to be. We are putting them up here on top of our hill and going to pasteurize our pigs and put them in here so they can clean up all of this for us. We are relocating the pen from where the garden is to up here for a purpose to obviously cultivate rut up this entire area and help us improve the soil up here i've tried in the past to get a tractor into here but there's so much heavy brush and roots and rocks in here that i can't do it without breaking my lawnmower and i'm not willing to risk that so we're going to have our pigs do it and so this is another major project that we need to do. Okay, so as you've seen, we've seen a couple of different options and a diff lot of different uh, projects that we need to do on our homestead. As you know, being a homesteader and a farmer or a rancher, whatever you want to call yourself, the list never is ending. Um, so these are just a few of the high priority lists for us. And the project that if I could snap my fingers that I could have completed and be done with by far would have to be the grass and the soil, especially in the back pasture. Um, we love our cows grazing. We don't give them any grain. Uh, we don't give them much supplements. We do give them some uh, protein cubes for treats um, and that's it. Uh, some minerals, water obviously. And so if I could have some good high quality grass out there and snap my fingers so that they could enjoy on it and graze on it all summer long and possibly into the winter time. That is my number one thing that I, if I could snap my fingers, it would be done. All right, so now that we've got our major project that if we could snap our fingers, that it would be done, um, we are gonna call out three other channels um, to see they seem to be pretty busy and going to see exactly what they would do if they could snap their fingers and one project be done. And those three channels are the Clueless Homesteaders, 
Sunshine Farm of New York, and Kinfolk Farms. Hopefully you guys can participate. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and hit that bell for the notifications so you'll get our future videos. Thank you.